Glory to Dark Kind. Welcome back to Dak Game Shorts. I'm Shays, and today we're going to be taking a look at a game that you, you probably think is Shays. You know, this game doesn't look finished, it doesn't look right. You know how, like, when you're baking a cake? And you gotta open the oven and you wanna go check the cake and you wanna see how good the like Ooh, it's almost ready. Oh, I could do a little bit more. That's <laughs> That's what this is like. I don't know why I picked that analogy. It's cause it's too hot in here and I needed to wear my jacket. Casting Couch is made by Hitami, a female voiceover artist diving into the interactive story scene of Shady Games. You play as someone who's starting out in the industry, trying to make his way by any lewd means possible. Cause we all know... There's always money in a banana stand. Being made by one person, this is a pretty decent concept, and a pretty decent go at it. It plays out like a sim date style game mixed with missions. You can hone in on your skills at the office, grinding them socials, hiring people on the casting couch, and making that cash. Or explore the world, take on quests, and even work part time jobs and do missions. This is actually way too close to my life, IRL. Now, I do say straight away, I'm not a fan of the visuals. Your eyes are the money point. It's where we're looking. So, the visuals are a big sell in the sexy game market. Inconsistencies in visuals too also give me a cause to pull away at times. But, there is something here. The idea of building stats by reading or working at the bar for more social stats. Time grinding to obtain fame to meet people in the streets. Even the stories that go between take it away from a simple click and wait style game. So what does the game need? It needs polishing. If you can polish these foundations that you've created, you could actually have yourself a pretty decent game. It just depends if you're willing to do it. Touches of comedy appear here and there as well, which if done right could be a good go to time waster of a game. And with the ability to have some online support, who knows what you could plan by syncing the game up to a server and providing your players with rewards. As I said before, it's the visuals for me, and the visuals are usually the first thing that I'm going to be judging the game on. But, this game does have foundations for what could be a pretty decent game down the road. And it goes to show that Hintami knows how to do it. She's also quite a talented voice actress, so she's already got my attention in the ears. A soft summer's wind blows outside, stirring the leaves above your window. Want to check out our Patreon? Give us some feedback and some support? Hitami, don't be swayed by what I say today. What got me was the ideas you have. Now we just need the polish that will take it out of the gate. Well, that's it for this episode of Dak Game Shorts. I'm Shades, and remember... You get what you paid for. <laughs> Good night.